Okay, good evening. My name is Brad Novartis, and tonight I'm going to be demonstrating a speech on how to build a website for free in 10 minutes or less. Um, before I get started, um, there's a couple of things that we might want to discuss as to reasons why you might want to make a website. I'm sure everybody in this room has thought of a reason why they might want to make a website, either for personal reasons, um, business reasons. You can make a website for groups or organizations or just for fun. I'm going to be using a PowerPoint presentation tonight for a demonstration on how to build this website as my visual aid. First thing we need to do is decide what type of website it is. So if you want to go ahead and hit the next slide, please. First thing we're going to do is search for a free service. The website I used is Weebly. It's a free website, internet, internet website service, and you can also do free blogs there. Uh, next slide, please. Once you get to the Weebly website, you're going to want to create a free account. And what I usually do beforehand is create a free uh, email address at maybe Gmail or even Hotmail.com. And that way, when you put an email address on your website, it can seem authentic to the name that you decide for your website. Uh, next slide, please. Once you create your account with them, you're going to want to just go ahead and click uh, Create a Site up in the upper left-hand corner, and then it will also list any other websites you've made on this page here. Uh, next slide, please. All right, here's, the, here's where we get to naming the website. Uh, I obviously named mine uh, Brad's Awesome Website for this speech today. And the type of site that I chose was personal. You can do, like I said earlier, a business website, group organizations, education, uh, even weddings, portraits, or maybe just to share your opinions. Next slide, please. You want to choose the free domain at Weebly.com address because they give you the option down here to do it at just .com and then you're going to have to sign up and pay extra money. So their free option is the at weebly.com. You want to select that. So and here's where you type in the name of your website, what you want it to be with no spaces, and that's going to be your URL, which is going to be up in the HTTP area of your browser. Next slide, please. All right, now once you have chosen the name, it's going to bring you to the Weebly editor screen. Now I'm going to get my laser pointer here. You can see up here is your elements tab. And on this page right here, you have your texts. You can do picture with texts. You can even have Google AdSense, which is a sign up for a site where they can put ads on your website. And people click on them, they'll pay you money for them clicking on your ads. But for now, we're going to go to the Design tab and pick a design. Next slide, please. Here's where you're going to choose your theme. And over here, I have all themes. You're going to want to hit that, scroll down, choose any type of theme that you think might look good. Uh, next slide. This is the theme that I chose for the website. It's got a black background, and it shows your web tabs up in the upper right-hand corner and the name of your website up top. And now we're going to want to add pictures. Next slide. You're going to want to click on the edit image in the upper left-hand corner. And once you click that, it's going to prompt you to upload a picture. So the next slide. Up here is the add image. Click that. Then at this point, you can add any image that's on your computer or you can pick something off the internet. Next slide, please. And here it shows my computer, photo gallery, or the internet. You can choose your file from any of those to upload a picture. Next slide. Here's what it looks like when you first choose the picture. And it's going to give you options here to stretch the picture to fit on part of the website that you want it to. Um, so I went ahead and stretched it out left and right to match the background picture. And then I'm going to add text to it after that with effects. You 
you can see your effects are over here, fades. Close that out, please. Thank you. Next slide. So here it is stretched out. Now I'm going to click the add text. Once I add text, I'm going to want to save it. Next slide. Okay, and there's the text. Guns and beer with dirt bikes. Not a good idea. And we are going to add the background glow to it. It's just one of the effects. Then we go back to the element page after we save it. Next slide. Now we can go ahead and add more to our website. What we'll do is we will grab the paragraph with a picture, click it, and drag it down onto the page. And then right there you'll be able to click here to edit, add another picture, and add some text to that. Next slide. And here's kind of like what I did. I added another picture here, added some text to it. And then a little comment about the picture. Next slide, please. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and add other pages to our website. So what we've done is we've named the next page after clicking on new page, and then we'll hit save down there. Next slide. And here you can see it reflects the new page that you've made. So it's a photo gallery page. And then you will click on the photo gallery page to edit that page. Next slide. Here's an extra photo that I did on there for demonstration purposes. After that, click the next page. And you're going to click the publish page. And it's as easy as that. It shows, shows your web address right here, which you can copy and paste. Um, you can also share on Facebook, and it'll automatically post your web page on there with the URL and everything for one click. And like I said earlier, you can use this for home business. If you're selling stuff with PayPal, you can put a link to the PayPal on there. So the applications are limitless. Next slide. Here I just have a breakdown of the three easy steps in less than 10 minutes. You can create, design, publish a web page. Next slide. And thank you for your time. Go ahead and film the audience again, please. <laughs> that was good. All right. Thank you.